Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how I make coconut liquid soap from scratch. You can use it for laundry, I use it to mop the floor, to wash my hands when they're really dirty, to wash all my counters, um, to wash the bathroom. It's so useful, it's so simple, it's completely natural, oh so good. So first I'm going to be adding my potassium hydroxide light to the water. Now this is something to be really careful about. You know, read all about life safety and the process of liquid soap making if you're ever going to make soap. This is just, you know, a little demo about how I do it. So once the lye is completely stirred in and dissolved, I'm adding my coconut oil, measuring very carefully down to the minute milligram. And it's only like three ingredients, that's all. So I'm going to be using an immersion blender now to combine everything. Now it's all going into my crock pot, um, slow cooker, and then I'm going to emulsify it a bit more just to make sure everything comes together really well. Then I'm going to cook it on low heat for about 3 to 4 hours until it is it has gone through all the stages of liquid soap making the soap is completely saponified so that there is no more active lye in there so you know it's going to go through various stages applesauce stage etc etc but the last stage that is the most important is vaseline stage so it basically turns to vaseline um, it's going to look very clear and gel-like and thick and then I'm adding water to kind of dilute it down to a liquid soap. That could take some time to continue cooking until it is completely dissolved. And also make sure that, you know, the pH is correct, that there aren't any like, you know, active bits of lye in there and stuff like that. Make sure it's a completely cooked soap. Then I'm going to pour it out into bottles, big bottles, small bottles. Um, I find it useful to put it in these upcycled bottles and basically you can use it for anything around the house. Anything that needs soap needs to be cleaned. For example, washing hands if they are very oily. You know, this is a cleansing soap. It can be a bit drying, but let's say you've been like, I don't know, butchering uh, a cow or something. This is really good. So anyway, if you like this video, do like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more. Bye!